you can now download the G Suite file stream utility for your account. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download that utility, install it on the Windows PC, and a little bit on how it works. If you want to see the difference between the two versions, be sure to check out my previous video where I compare the two. I also have another video where I'll show you how to install Drive File Stream for the Mac. You can see that in the video description as well. First go to drive.google.com in your browser. In your My Drive, choose the settings gear and then select Download Drive File Stream for Windows. You'll get to the support article where you can learn all about Google Drive File Stream and here's the download button for Windows. This should start the download process as Google Drive File Stream.exe. Open this file once it has finished downloading. Once the installer has started, you can close down your Chrome browser. Wait for the installer to complete, then click close. You'll get the sign in to Google Drive prompt. Sign in with your G Suite account and click next. You'll enter your G Suite password, click next. If you have the recommended two-step verification enabled for your account, enter in the six-digit code and click Next. Great, your file streams is now connected with the user account that you signed in with. We can now start using Google Drive file streams. From your Windows File Explorer, You'll notice this G Drive, Google Drive File Stream, and I have access to My Drive, as well as Team Drives if that's enabled for your domain. All your files are available here. You can just double click on them anytime and open the corresponding file. But they're not taking up space. They will be downloaded whenever we want them and any files we put in here will be in sync with Google Drive on the web also. If I wanted to make sure that Drive files were available offline with me, I could now individually select a file, right click on it, under Drive File Stream, choose Available Offline. You'll notice the icon will change with the checkmark box, indicating that it is now downloaded onto the PC. Any of the files we select in Drive will open with the Windows corresponding app. Here I'm opening an image and it opens with the Windows Image Viewer. The file stream app will be running in your Windows taskbar here. You can also use it to access your file stream. Right click on the icon to view more info. From here opening the Google Drive folder will open the Windows File Explorer window. The More menu will allow you to pause syncing, switch your account, sign out, or quit the utility altogether. If you sign out of the utility, you may be prompted again for your two-step verification code. 